What's up? My name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and in today's quick video, I'm going to show you how to enable a new feature for the new Windows 2004 update, Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling. What exactly is it before we get to enabling it? Well, basically on mid to lower end PCs, it should eventually reduce input lag, though right now it's still in the early stages and may not help that much. In theory, it should help free up a bit of the CPU. So how exactly do we enable this? Well, simply press start and type in graphics. Then we'll head into graphics settings. And when we're in here, simply enable hardware accelerated GPU scheduling as such. Assuming you don't see this option up here, make sure that you're on the newest Windows 2004 update. How do we check? Well, simply hold start and press R to bring up this run dialog. Then type in winver as such and hit enter. Then we'll get some info on the current version of Windows. As you can see, Microsoft Windows 10 version 2004. Assuming yours is 2004 or better, then you should have this feature. Assuming that you don't, simply press start and type in update. Head across to Windows Update and check for updates. If you see something about upgrading to the Windows 2004 update, simply make sure to click that button. Assuming that you don't see an update, you don't see the Windows 2004 update button, and you're not on Windows 2004 or better already, how exactly do we upgrade? Well, we can force it with the Windows 10 Upgrade Assistant. Simply head across to the link down in the description below and you'll be taken to a page like this for download Windows 10. Don't worry, all you have to do is click Update Now over here and you'll download an update tool for the May 2020 update. Simply run this tool, follow the steps and eventually your PC should be updated to the latest version then you should be able to go ahead and enable this new GPU scheduling option. If you are on Windows 2004 and you still don't have the option, make sure that your dedicated graphics card drivers are up to date, meaning update your NVIDIA graphics card drivers or your AMD graphics card drivers. Then after a full restart of Windows, that option should be available. Of course, you may not see a huge difference if you have a really good PC, or even if you have a relatively bad PC and you enable it, currently there may not be a huge difference, but at least in future Windows updates, with this feature enabled, you may see some differences if Microsoft comes across some breakthroughs, but who knows, maybe this will help your PC in some way or another. But anyways, that's about it for this video. Hopefully you found something useful in it. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!